What's up guys? Our favorite day of the week has come around again. It's Tuesday and that means it's time to do a little damage on our credit cards and go Blu-ray hunting. The big new releases for today, we have Cabin in the Woods on 4K Steelbook from Lionsgate. We have Heavy Metal Steelbook, Jackass Forever on Blu-ray, as well as In the Heat of the Night on 4K. Now my plan for today is hitting up just two stores, Best Buy and Target. I'm not really sure what I'm going to be picking up. It's kind of one of those days I'm just going to go out there and see what finds me. So let's go out there, see what we can find. What are we waiting for? Let's go. Stop number one of the day. Here we go. We're going into Best Buy. And the new releases at Best Buy. Boom. I see heavy metal, two copies on Steelbook. So let me take this out to show you really quickly. I'm probably not going to pick this up only because I had no idea what heavy metal was and then a couple of you were commenting and letting me know and I'm probably never going to watch this but this is what the steelbook looks like in case you guys were interested in picking it up. The first movie is 4k and blu-ray and the second movie is blu-ray only so you do have the double pack but the second movie is only on blu-ray so we do have that option. Still have Halloween Kills. Dune, Come On, Come On, Matrix Resurrections, West Side Story, Ghostbusters Afterlife, plenty of F9s and Space Jams and Candymans and, and Jungle Cruise. Let's head on over to the other side. See what we got going on. We still have plenty of Spider-Man No Way Homes. We have one three-pack left. Sing 2 on 4K. Dexter New Blood. It looks like the Blu-ray is on sale for $28.99. Still have some Eternal Steelbooks at $32.49 it looks like. Oh, The Hunger Games is on sale. It's $10 off, so now it's $79.99. So if you're interested in the Hunger Games box set, I highly recommend you pick it up for $79.99. Still got some Scream on 4K on sale. Eternals DVD, Blu-ray, 4K. Still got Catwoman Hunted, regular Scream, or the remake of Scream, not, what am I talking about? Scream 5, <laughs> Scream 5 on Blu-ray and 4K, American Underdog, The Hurt Locker on Steelbook for $17.99, so that's a great price for that, Shang-Chi, 4K, Blu-ray, DVD, Venom 2, okay, all the usual suspects, so far, so far the only new one is heavy metal on 4k steelbook right here so this is the only new title so far so let me go in the back and see what i can find in the new releases in the back of the store there is still more spider-man no way home they do have the 4k slip covers back here which is nice matrix resurrections are still here jack reacher steelbook we still have copies of the robocop box set. I'm actually kind of surprised. Maybe not, but they're just such a nice set. I picked mine up last week. Last looks from last week. We still have West Side Story. Death on the Nile 4K is $28.99. A big dollar discount, but that's still not enough for me to pick up that title, unfortunately. And Kanto is still here. All the usual ones. They still have copies of the Kingsman box set back up to $53.99 if you're interested in that. Dune. Forever Apex, Free Guy. All right, let's see if we can find more new releases. Here we go, Jackass Forever and The Humans. These are both newly out today at $19.99. I believe The Humans right now on Amazon is $14.99, so I'm gonna see if I can price check that and get it for the cheaper discount. And we still have copies of Chucky, Mary Shelley's Frankenstein from last week, Marry Me, Nightmare Alley, we also have some anime titles, or Studio Studio Ghibli titles, anime, Only Yesterday, and The Tale of the Princess Kaguya. I'm not sure if I said that right, probably not. Don't say anything if I butchered it <laughs> down in the comments. House of Gucci, F9. That's really all that's happening. I'm surprised. I see no Cyrano. That was newly out today, so I don't see any Cyrano. Maybe that'll be at Target. And we have all the other basic new releases that have been coming out. We got the Godfather Blu-ray trilogy set for $37.99 right there. Still got that Harry Potter steelbook for $26.99. I'm trying to see if I can find any sales to point out to you guys. 
The Green Knight 4K is $19.99. Wonder Woman 84 4K is $21.99 if you guys are interested. It looks like Snake Eyes is still at $12.99. Jungle Cruise $29.99 for the 4K. That's pretty much all that's going on. Not really a whole heck of a lot today. So I'm going to go up to the 4K section and see if I can find anything in the front. Best Buy did wind up having the Heavy Metal Steelbook. I was actually surprised to see it there because I honestly didn't think it was going to be there. And the one that I thought was going to be there, Cabin in the Woods, was not there. And this is why I pre-order because the same thing occurred with La La Land. I still have not seen that Steelbook anywhere in my local Best Buy store. So let me know down below. Have you seen Cabin in the Woods or La La Land Steelbook in your local Best Buy? But I guess I was pleased with what I saw today. There were some options for new releases, Heavy Metal along with Jackass Forever and The Humans. But like I said, they didn't have Cabin in the Woods or Cyrano, but that's not really a big deal. This week, it's kind of eh for the new releases. There really isn't anything huge that I'm going for. So I'm kind of just me meandering around the store just to see what I could find. And I will say I did find another 4K with a great slip cover, but I'm not done yet. One more store to go. As always, we're going to Target. Final stop of the day, as always, every single week is the Target. We're going into Target. We're going into Target. In the new release set, Target, Spider-Man No Way Home is still at the top on Blu-ray and DVD, but here is Cyrano, so if you were looking to pick up Cyrano, you got to come to Target on Blu-ray for $24.99, as well as The Humans on Blu-ray for $16.99. I was able to price match that at Best Buy for $14.99, just to let you know. The King's Daughter, this is also a brand new release that was not at Best Buy. If you're interested, it's at Target for $16.99. They do have Jackass Forever Blu-ray and DVD. Blu-ray is $19.99, DVD is $17.99, and they still have copies of Scream and Come On, Come On. Back at home, it's time for me to show you what I got when I went out today. Now, I apologize about the lack of filming in Target today. I pretty much only showed you what was brand new for releases right in the front because when I went to the middle aisle where everything else is kept, there really weren't any of the red ticket sales happening and I've shown you the same movies over and over again and I don't want you guys to get bored. So let's just move on to what's important. What did I pick up today? Three things, however, one of them is currently in transit, and that is the Cabin in the Woods 4K Steelbook from Lionsgate. It is not here yet. It's not coming until tomorrow, which kills me. I don't understand why some people get them two weeks early, and then I always manage to get them late for some reason. I never get a Steelbook early, but it's on the way. So unfortunately, I cannot show you that in this video. However, I will post it on my Instagram, so make sure you're following me over there at Movies and Sue, so that way when I do post the photo, you will not miss it. I'll do a complete unboxing on my Instagram, okay? So make sure you're following over there. But I will show you, now let's get into what I did pick up today. One title brand new off the shelf today, and then another title is Nostalgia, a 4K with a slipcover. Because it was a lackluster week of picking up, I decided to pull the trigger on. So the first movie, is The Humans. This was brand newly released today. Another A24 title. They're just cranking them out. Now, this movie I hear is a slow burn of a film and will not be for everyone. However, I think I'm going to enjoy it because it's based off of a stage play. I appreciate movies like that because I was a theater major. So I'm used to movies translating from a stage, from a stage play to a film. I'm used to movies like that, so I think I will enjoy it. Plus, it's a family drama around the holiday, Thanksgiving, and I usually like movies like that. So that's the reason why, why I wanted to pick it up. Plus, it has a very nice slip cover on it, as A24 titles usually do. So I'm looking forward to watching this whenever I can. And I did mention this in the video when I was in Target showing it off. I did manage to price match this at Best Buy. Because right now on Amazon, it's $14.99 and Best Buy, it was listed for $19.99. So definitely, if you go after the humans at Best Buy, price match it, $14.99. Save $5. There you go. So my next and final pickup, like I said, total nostalgia, but it's one of the best movies to come out of the 80s. And that is The Goonies, man. The Goonies! And I just... 
I'm really digging that slipcover. The reason why I picked it up is because of the slipcover. I do have the steel book, but I don't believe my steel book is a 4K. I think it's just a regular Blu-ray steel book of the Goonies. So I definitely wanted to get the Goonies with a nice slipcover on 4K because in these not so exciting release weeks, that's what I've been trying to do to peruse through my 4K section and and bulk up my 4K uh, my 4K collection with slip covers that I might have missed out on at cheaper prices. So this one I paid, I believe, $22.99 for, a little bit more expensive than what I have been spending. But because I only got one other item, it really wasn't that bad. So that is everything that I picked up today. Not a lot of stuff, but sometimes the wallet needs a break. But the big important question is, what did you find when you went out today? Let me know down below. Did you have Cabin of the Woods Steelbook in your Best Buy? Don't forget to like and subscribe before you leave, and I'll see you next time.